Hey, what's good, good time? Today we're going to be spending a whole day in Selfridges, which is a super famous luxury department store. There's one in London, which we're now going to be heading to, but there's also one in Manchester, I think. If you think, though, that Selfridges is just about clothes shopping, especially designer clothes shopping, you'd be wrong. Because over the past year, since we've been living in London, we've been going there, and each time we discover something new there's that so is inside there. Selfridges. Yeah. There is so much we're going to be doing today in there. We're going to be taking you along. We'll probably discover showing you all of the stuff. things that you can do in there it's gonna be so fun guys the taxi's just dropped us off this van and we are here so much Yay. so i feel like we should go and walk through the little spinning doors but you're probably wondering why on earth has mia brought her skateboard that is a good question you're gonna find out Very later good question. so it's just opened up and i want to go in and have my breakfast because guys we're gonna be spending all day in here so we need to eat and selfridges does not let you down in food no, does it right okay let's go girls yay there are so many food options but for breakfast we're gonna go to the feel good bar because they do the best soft serve ice cream and they also have some other stuff. If you're wondering why we can be having ice cream for breakfast, it's really, really healthy and it's made out of matcha, which you guys know we absolutely love. Hi. Hi. So guys, look behind me at the menu. You can get like all smoothies with cacao and shrooms in it. You can get a rose and collagen latte. You can get ginger and tamarind. There's so many nice things in here. And that look, looks amazing. I know. Oh, and they've even got their new ice cream now. That looks so amazing. We love it, guys. This is going to be a great start for a busy day in here. Yeah. <laughs> wow, look at this fizz van. That looks so incredible. Mm. Oh. My favorite soft tub ever. So good. Mm. Yeah. I've even taken some of my friends here and they don't like matcha and they said that this is really good. If you've got like basically ice cream cravings but you want to eat healthier stuff, this is incredible. I really, really love it, guys. That was delicious. Oh, I feel so, so good. Yeah. By the way, so we didn't say what it's made out of, but the soft serve is made out of loads of nuts. That's why it's oh, like it? super healthy. Yeah. I didn't know that. Also, in this area as well, there's loads of like really cool supplements. They've even got a little fridge here full of like liposomal vitamins. This looks really, really good. It's got Irish sea moss in it. Just really cool. So they've got a nice little health section as well, which is the perfect start to our day, isn't it? So when you walk out of this bit, then you are in the beauty section, which okay. is one of my favourite sections. Yeah, yeah. You love the it as well, don't yeah. you? I love getting with perfumes and making my underwear draw smell nice. Oh. <laughs> I literally am obsessed with the minis. Something about them is just so cute. I don't know what it is. I know. They're probably overpriced considering you're getting a smaller product, but it just, it's, it's just, yeah. it's, it's amazing. Yeah, so they have like a couple of aisles here just dedicated to minis or like sample sizes or travel sizes. And um, I like buying these because then I don't feel guilty because I've bought a mini one and I haven't bought the full one. And then I end up collecting loads, which is kind of, I need to use up all my minis at home. I love walking around here as well just because there's loads of new brands like especially like vegan ones and natural ones that like I haven't heard of before like this one I haven't tried this one but this scented one looks good daily calm the conditioner calm do you can see it <laughs> I love that it looks really really cool I think I might try this but I've like I said I've got to use up all of my other stuff at home first rather than keep buying like I see a new one and then I want to buy it and try it I just love like trying new beauty products so you Sienna and yeah. Mia yeah don't you love same. it and then also you can even get your brows done in here over there there's like a nail bar there's a blow dry bar there and then also i think you can get massages in here another beauty treatment oh, yeah. can i go look at the wigs please Wait, what? Wait. Yeah. if you want okay come on come on guys comment down below which color you think i should do my hair next like get some streaks or something in it purple wow, that's lovely. rainbows yellow blue oh i think i've been feeling like good. i need to do something different with my hair yeah I yeah think. i feel the same way what do you think? I'm not sure. Mia, I think you should either go really blonde or dark. I agree. Yeah, I think I, dark. Comment down below what oh, what you think Mia should do to change her hair. I think she should either go brunette or go super blonde. Think, not be in between. I mm -hmm. think brunette. I was like, I was like, yeah. so you look like with brown hair. That would be yeah. fun. And we could do like a day where we swap. Like, that would be fun. Right, <laughs> guys, I'm, I'm looking at that. The back grub. So we're just gonna stand here and watch you. You might forget my back is hurting so much. Okay. Okay. Do you mind? So. <laughs> yeah, are you sure? Yeah. yeah. Right. Honestly, my shoulders are hurting. I'm gonna ask them if they can have a back rub. Okay. It was really uh intense. 
Um, yeah, the man was really oh. digging into like the muscle. Basically, all the top of my shoulders are really tense. That was really, really good. I only had like a 10 minute one. I feel, he said I need to have like some sports um, deep tissue massages. Right. Yeah, because he said there's a okay. lot of tension in there. Sorry, girl, I hope you don't mind me just having that no, little right. brief interlude. We've got all day. That's all my makeup rubbed off because my face is no, pressed down great. in it. My face is like squishing into that thing. Yeah. And I was worried about my makeup, but oh, <laughs> I feel like I'm like inches taller. Ruler. Yeah, yeah, I do. Right, shall we go and show the Fifth Family, yeah? The action packed surprise in here. You should tell them the story okay. of this. Right, so one time me and Sienna wanted to find a new skate park. So beforehand, we went out with mum and then we were in Selfridges because mum wanted to get that soft serve. And I was like, oh, let's see like where's the closest skate park to Oxford Street. Look it up, it says like 300 feet away. I'm like, what? I look at it. So apparently there's a skate bowl in Selfridges. So we're in the men's streetwear section and can you hear that sound? Can you hear that? It's so unexpected that it's just randomly in here because the weird thing is I felt like I'd been in this section before but never noticed it I until I found out that it existed. Ta-da! Wow. It looks like a cake. It's ball. I know. And there's also another good ice cream place right there. And this wow. is where I love. Oh, treat. Haven't actually been skating in maybe three weeks. So I'm a bit, I'm gonna be rusty. Mia really, really wants me to come because for ages she wants me to go and watch her do a drop in. So she's like desperate for mummy to see her, aren't you? For mummy to come. I had soft serve today. I am hungry. Are you? And I need a wee. No, I always actually, like skating is actually quite like nerve wracking. Like I do always get a bit nervous beforehand. Yeah. Okay, yeah. You're gonna have to give me five minutes to warm up and then I'll try or drop it. Okay. Safety first, Fizz fam. We're happy to see that, aren't we? Who really does it when you're here? That's not true. <laughs> Look at Mia, she's really nervous. I think Mia wants to warm up first and then, then she'll want me to look at her doing the yeah. drop-in. So, shall we let her warm up? Yeah, I always have to warm up. And, well, I have to admit, like, I had this mental block, like, about four months ago or something, and I haven't done a drop-in since. And I was the first person to, like, learn how to do a drop-in. I've been able to do it for two years or something, but then I just had a mental block and I couldn't do it anymore. I haven't warmed up that much, but I'm still going to try and do a drop-in. Okay, go on, Mia. I've done it, like, hundreds of times. Wow. I'm really proud of her. I'm uh, so, so proud of you. Yeah. Like if I was here for like an hour. Yeah, if I was here for like an hour, I'd be a lot more yeah. balanced. One know? time, me and Mia stayed here for like three hours straight. No, and more. Like, uh, we've been yeah. here for like four or five hours yeah. some days. And they are the days when they come back home like crying. They're like crawling to the kitchen like, Mom, we're so hungry. And they're like shaking from like just pure exhaustion. No, it's like they've just gone to the gym and they've been weightlifting for four hours. They come back and they're like a shaking mess. Do you want to carry on skateboarding for a bit? And me and Senna will um, have a look around. I need to eat some more stuff. Maybe I'll come you back. Want some more food? Should yes, we get I, need some, I need some I know, food. we're going to take you somewhere. Downstairs, oh, on, in the basement, there is something really incredible. If you love chocolate and sweets and treats, this is like going to Willy Wonka's factory, isn't it? We're now in the best part of Selfridges, AKA the confectionery bit. And there's actually a place here which sells vegan macarons and I've never That's tried it, so but they good. have tried it. Yeah. And I have to try it today, I have Come to. On. Yeah. <laughs> so guys, can we just take them this way first, Mia? Because all along here, there's these most fancy, like posh oh, yeah. chocolate the fine, counters. Oh, the fine jewelry as well. Oh, and there's fine jewelry. There's yeah. fine chocolate and there's fine jewelry. Like you can get all these slabs of chocolate here. That looks so good. You can get all these like delectable filled dates. And then we have all of these gorgeous chocolates. Look. Wow. <laughs> Honestly, if you love chocolate, this is like heaven. There's like giant Easter eggs, giant Easter bunnies. <gasps> Wow, look at that. Wow. I can't wait for Easter. It's a place, isn't it? Ooh, yeah. yeah. I'm literally so excited to try this because I don't think I've ever had a macaroon. Macaroon is French as well. Isn't I it? know. You've that restaurant, remember? So oh, yeah, I have. Yeah. La Dorie. La Dorie. Yeah. Dorie. Okay, so there's a raspberry Ooh. one or a chocolate one. Oh, there's a hazelnut oh, and Ooh. caramel. Ooh. We had, when we came here, I think I had. I had caramel. And I had. 
hazelnut. No, I had Ooh. raspberry. I'm and that was have delicious. Hazelnut, I think. I might try raspberry. I, I. Comment down below, Fizz Family, if you've tried macaroons before. Mia, it's sensational. It's like a combination of like a cookie and a cake. I don't know. It's, it's so good, Mia. I can't yeah. wait for you to try it. Thank, Thank you. you. Oh, wow. Look how fancy this box wow. is. I'm keeping the box. I knew. Yeah. I was going to say to you to keep the box. Wow. Let's see. Can I try it? Let's go over there. Raspberry, raspberry macaroon. <laughs> <laughs> She's never eaten a macaroon before. You turned into a jammy dodger. Mmm, <laughs> that is heavenly. Yeah. That is actual heaven. I'll try the hazelnut. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> try caramel, Fizz Fam. Fizz Fam, let's try one together. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Oh, We're all just going, mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. And you know what that means? It means it's good. And we have the perfect amount here for this fam for Darren, Pua, and Palmer. Oh, we should take yeah. this home for them. But then obviously, Senna will let you keep the box. Yeah. <laughs> How beautiful. Now, Mia, I know you wanted the snack. Was that enough, or do you want more for skating? More. And I want a drink. <laughs> right, so there's a food court here as well. And in the food court, there's loads of like sort of, I wouldn't say restaurants, but loads of places to eat. And there's like a health food store in there. There's like, it's a mini supermarket. And there's me as favorite thing Let's in the show whole you world. anyway. Let's stop talking about it and actually show you. Welcome to where the food lays. I, I don't know why I'm doing that voice, okay. I'm sorry. Right, you know girls, we're gonna be in here all day. Yeah. So like, we have lots of opportunities to try lots of things. Because usually when I come here, there's so much in here. I don't know what to try. Like as you can see behind me, there's an ice cream place. There's a cookie place, there's a Lola's cupcakes, and then they also have like bits where you can buy like actual food, which and is- And they have the ramen place. Mia's oh, yeah. obsessed with ramen, aren't you? Look what this is, spirulina water. Ooh, that sounds well interesting. Yeah, so they have loads of like healthy juices and things in here, and kind of, they also have all like of the normal Cokes and things. So it's like a nice thing to pick, depending on what you like. And then I really love discovering new brands. They usually have loads of nice new sort of Kombuchas in here and healthy oh, fizzy yeah. drinks. What are you gonna get, Mia? This sounds really interesting. Yeah, what are you gonna get, Sienna? I think I'll get um, the ginger ale. I love this. Ooh. Is that by Karma Drinks? Yeah. yeah. This is the brand that Karma started up. Four year old entrepreneur. Yeah. <laughs> and then also, I'm gonna be getting what actually looks good. Girls, wait for mummy. <gasps> oh, I really wanna try this. This is a new one I haven't seen before. This is Momo Kombucha. And it's got a great taste award, so I love great Look, taste award stuff. Vegan ice cream sandwiches. I've never seen those. Before. Wow. I was really drawn to this section here called Acid League. I was like, what's that about? Is that to do with vinegar? And it is. And look what you can get. You can get strawberry rose living vinegar. So it's like kind of guys. Did you know that vinegar is mum's favourite hobby? She just is obsessed with vinegar. Look at that. Wow. Toaster Thai coconut vinaigrette. Okay, I'd best leave mum here to help. Bye mum, have fun with the vinegars. <laughs> Look, next to you, Mum, that's my favourite place. Oh, yeah, Mia loves the ramen place. I vote we get that later. Mum's not so keen on ramen. She says it's too oily for her. I love it. I love it so much. Look, look at these chips. Mum. Wow, look how cool these are. Look, and they have like the American cereals as oh my well gosh, here. I've never noticed that. Like basically, if you're feeling bored and you just want to go and get some exciting food, this is the place yeah, for it. Yeah, come here. I wouldn't recommend probably doing your weekly shopping here though. It's a cookie mix. That is so cool. Wow. Flour, sugar, oats. Wow, look at this amazing. That is literally, that's so aesthetic. Imagine having that on the side in your kitchen. I know, you'd yeah. never want to use it because you just want to keep it yeah. like that. And then it's like, I don't know, I can just imagine great idea. the cookies like, coming out have... really bad because you like cook it wrong. DIY gift. You could try and make this yourself and it could be an amazing Ooh. gift for somebody. Guys, that is literally that's... ingenious. Yeah, that's the new like idea. She's going to go She's gonna go home and like, Mum, have you got any old vinegar jars, aren't you? <laughs> uh, no, I don't think I'll use an old vinegar jar. It'll probably make me well, a that's the only thing mum buys. Every time she does the food shopping, it's half of it's vinegar. So me and Sienna are like trying to go down to trying to find a snack and all there is is vinegar. I just found some of my favourite crispies, the Pekin Duck flavour seaweed chips. Are they vinegar flavour? No, Pekin Duck. No, talking about vinegar flavour. <laughs> talking about no, they're vinegar, not. They're, my, they're actually my favourite Vegan and vegan ones yeah. and the seaweed crisp. I'm going to go and get this mm. as my little snack while I watch you do skateboarding. What are you going to mm. get? Well, um, go on, get you some snacks. Well, Sienna's going to take ages, isn't she? Yeah. My favourite snack 
is these chocolate and salted caramel crunchy peas. They don't taste anything like peas. I actually love them. Also, I love olives. I have a thing for olives. So I can't really have a go at mum for her vinegar obsession, can I? Because olives is also a bit weird. Onion flavored macadamia nuts. Ooh, that Ooh. sounds good. So we're just gonna hang around here now, Fizz Fan. Mia's gonna do some more skating. Me and Sienna are gonna chill with yeah. the snacks. And then after that, we'll take you around some more of the really cool places in Selfridges. Me and Sienna have left Mia behind at the skate bowl because we actually thought that would come down and look at the book department. Me and Sienna are big book geeks, aren't we? I love the smell of them. Sienna loves to read them. <laughs> yeah, we're now looking at the cookbooks. I love cookbooks by guys. I actually really enjoy reading them, not just making the recipes out of them. Oh, look at that one. That one looks funny. Pasta grannies, comfort cooking. We've actually got this one at home. It's oh, yeah. In Japanese, we've got this one. This actually is a really good one to read as well. This is really, really it's such a beautiful book. Mm. Oh, look. We've got the vegetarian Mexican cookbook. Yeah, I feel like these are in categories of not it being vegan, but of the different cuisines, Sienna. Yeah, you know that um, Japanese one? I always read it when I'm hungry, but it's a bad idea because it makes me even more hungry. Meat free Mowgli. Simple, delicious plant-based Indian meals. That looks I nice. I spotted the Leon one. Oh yeah. Oh, they have got a lot here. This is actually a vegan section. Vegan fast food, copycat burgers, tacos, fried chicken, milkshakes and more by Brian Watson, aka The Burger Dude. Wow, I'd love to meet you. Also over there, I've noticed loads of coffee table books. Do you know Ooh. what those are, Sienna? Like decorational books that you never read. Yeah, they're kind of like pretentious books. <laughs> yeah. Although we do actually have a little collection of coffee table books and me and Sienna do read them. I do actually like sitting down and looking through them. They're like kind of like Nordic designs Ooh, ones and one of see. London. <gasps> What? Oh, that looks nice. Are there any books that you want, Sin? I'll, I'll treat you to some, yeah, oh, if you want you. any books today. Oh, wow. They've got Ooh, loads I of little mini ones. ones. I like these as well. There's a little Hermes book. Mm. Hermes, I think that's how you say it. I've got a Coco Chanel one. The mini Coco one. Coco Chanel. Though, yeah. Not that one, but. Look behind you, Sienna, though. What? <gasps> oh, these are proper sure. coffee table books. Oh, wow. Wow. Beautiful. I wonder how much these are, but 110 pounds. Oh, okay. Oh, look, I've got that one. Yeah, because Sienna's got a sewing machine and I know that she likes drawing and designing, so I've got her some fashion books. So we're not just getting you, oh, you've got a little fashion book. They are actually to help inspire Sienna. Some of them are very, um, to say, interesting and funny. <laughs> the pictures, I think there's some funny, funny um, clothes on the models, isn't there, Sienna? Yeah. This one looks good. Wow. Oh, Chloe. Yeah, I like that one. We need Your dad would love that I so know, much. This one. Sienna. Cigars. <laughs> look. Ah! Uh, if this wasn't so heavy, I would actually buy this for you, Dad. Also, if it, if it wasn't like, I don't know how much it is, 300 pounds or something. <laughs> Wait, but look, I saw a price. Oh my, oh my goodness. 850 pounds. Okay, yeah, I. The, the the cigar one is one thousand. Nice okay, one they're, they're much more expensive than I thought. There's that other section you wanted to look at, isn't yep. there? It's the stationery section, but they also have moleskin books. I think that's how you say it. Um, and I do love moleskin notebooks. Bless little Sienna's heart. She really loves this brand moleskin. She hasn't got one yet, but maybe oh, for yeah. like your birthday. I have. I've what? got a small black one. Oh, have you? Yeah. yeah. You love stationery, don't you? Yeah. Hey, uh, you good... Yeah, I actually made some good progress with my skating. I warmed up and right. I did feel ooh, wobbly. Well Guess what Mia just did? She just came up to me and like made me jump. I was just sitting here relaxing. It's so funny because I saw Sienna first and I did exactly the same thing to her. And she was ah. talking to a shop assistant she, when uh, I did it. Huh. I've basically, whilst Mia's been sweating and going up and down in the bowl, I've just been sitting here relaxing. I've been reading Deepak Chopra. The Seven Spiritual Laws of Success. I love it. It's a whole chapter on the law of karma in there, which is really, really nice. And then also, guys, I'm going to treat myself. This is my little indulgence every month. It's the Hello Fashion. And the new oh, one is out. What I've just got to talk about fashion. <gasps> it's a giant knot in my hair. How did you get that? Well, I noticed it this morning when I was brushing my hair, and then I was like, oh, I need to spend ages getting that out, and then I forgot to do okay. it. Okay. Are you right? Guys, you know how I love stationery? Well, I love something even more mini stationery. Oh, that, have you found any books that you want? Um, I would like to get this, please. Yeah. yeah, there's not really. I've got like loads of books that I need to read. I've got loads from the library. Well, I've got one for you, Sienna. Yeah, I found this is the perfect book. I literally believed you. I was like, I was excited. I thought you found a really nice book. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like it's um, 
snack o'clock time. Mm -hmm. And then we'll take you, so right, so we're gonna go and show you another place, one of the cool places you can eat in here. I think I know where I'm gonna go. I'll go Ooh, take okay. you guys for a little treat. Oh, by the way, we once came here with you, don't we, me, in your video, and we actually went on the rooftop. There's a rooftop yeah. terrace. Was that for my video? Was it's it like Family a fire. It's your it's it's Family you. No, it's Family Fierce, but I was controlling it because it was Sienna getting to turn 18, like me. Oh yeah, we went, can you remember that? And we went on the rooftop, it's a five-star restaurant, but there's another really fancy, fun place in here, which we've got to take you fifth fancy. Yeah. And then we'll take you around Ooh. some of the clothes. We've got, to go, we've also, got to go to the clothes. Take you to a secret place. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, there's, there's, you know, there's basically, right. Let's go and get some food first. First of all, let's pay before we get in trouble. Cause that would just be pretty ironic if we actually got kicked out. Accidentally told off. <laughs> no, yep. we got told off for accidentally shoplifting. So we have headed all the way up to the top. Well, not the rooftop top top, but all the way up to the top to this section here where there's loads of nice restaurants. We're gonna eat here. Ellen Ellen Ellen. 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 Look at all the flowers. Yeah. I feel like Ellen Ellen, don't you agree girls? It's the most feminine pretty it's and gorgeous. just floral place ever it's so gorgeous everything's pink loads of flowers and they, and they have cakes the, they have the most beautiful cakes ever do you want to show them sienna yeah wow look at all these cakes is that cake it's like a cake pop beautiful look at all the colors and the strawberries look at that cake wow and they actually do have a really delicious vegan cake here and i think it's this vegan one here um this chocolate and hazelnut one at the back yeah that one's We've got our drink, so I got jasmine and lime. Look how beautiful this one is. This is a beetroot rose latte. Ooh, I got peach iced tea. Don't know why there's two straws, but. I'm not complaining. We're having a great time sitting here, but we've literally sat here for like at least 30 minutes. And all they've got to do is just cut up a bit of cake and make us a drink, but it's really, really busy in here, but we're having a nice time anyway. But we're just saying about how it's making the time pass by. Yeah. Because yeah. I just want to let you know, Fist Fab, we have never, ever spent a whole day in stuff, which is before. I'm not really going to say it's a challenge because it's actually really, really fun. Yeah. But we were just saying, I can't believe we've got to stay in here till it's dark. Yeah. I know, but luckily there's loads of things to do, isn't there, Mia? I have got a chocolate and hazelnut cake. I have tried this cake before, but it's literally so good. I got dark chocolate and chai sorbet or gelato or whatever. I always get confused with those names. I feel nice and like sickly now, you know. I feel yeah. good. Yeah, right. So if you just thought that Selfridges was all like just designer shops, you know, like Chanel and all the Gucci, actually there is, there are some really cool brands in here yeah, as well. Yeah, like loads unique of, ones. Yeah, there's like loads of organic eco brands, really cool streetwear brands. So there's lots in here to look at. Plus also there's lots of sportswear and athleisure, which I like. What are some of your favorite brands in here that you like looking at? Well, I know this brand's really popular. I, oh I yeah, they still know. always, I don't know how you say that. Yeah, I don't own anything from it though. No. And Carhartt. That's oh yeah, that's a, a good really one, isn't it? Brand. Yeah. Do you guys mind if we go and look at the sportswear at leisure? Yeah, yeah sure. sure. There's also a Skims in here as well, which is cool. I'll take you to that area, Fizz Fab. It's really, really cool. Bye. Oh, we just saw some of you fist fam. It was really nice to see you in here. One of you said that you watch our videos every single day, which is so nice. Thanks for the support and love. Wow. That's so cool. Yeah, that's Isn't cute. It? Yeah. Oh, Sienna, that's lovely. Also, Mia, Sienna, you know I love this brand, don't you? Yeah, yeah it's sporty really and rich. Cool. I actually got a couple of jumpers from here, but I think it's like the perfect affirmation that you're sporty and you're rich, don't you think? Yeah, it's good. <laughs> but no, no, what I like about them as well. A lot of the jumpers have like, like they will focus around wellness and oh, well-being. Like they nice. have lots on them that says like drink water, yeah. mood. Yeah. yeah, this one looks wellness, exercise, eat well, sleep more. So I like exactly. that. What you see every day, like your slogans and things like that, yeah. they're like positive ones. Like mm -hmm. you don't want a top saying lazy on it. Like what about my top that says I love making boys cry? Yeah, not that one. Like I always avoid <laughs> like, like, I just want to lay in bed, those types of ones. Yeah, For me personally, good. I actually like, you know, we're also in the skim section now, guys. Have any of you tried skims out? I haven't tried any of the underwear, but I've heard so many good things about how comfortable and flattering it is. I have got one of the long black dresses though, yeah. which is honestly really, really, oh, it fits amazing. But I haven't tried any of these. Do you like skims, Mia? Have Literally, the amount of TikToks of people trying them on and buying the stuff I've seen is actually crazy. Like, I do actually really want to try it. The pink 
range. I feel like that's new. That is so pretty. They have like a bodysuit and everything. Well, yeah. like the underwear stuff. Yeah, this is like nice. This top and everything. Oh, that's beautiful. It looks so. The underwear looks really, really good. I know. But do you know what? Because the girls know what I'm like, but I hate wearing underwear because it always digs in, cuts in. I, I hate can. it. Buy seamless underwear. No, but even seamless can cut in, and I hate it when I have all like bumps going up. So when I wear leggings, I don't wear any underwear because it shows through. TMI. So uncomfortable. TMI like, it's mom. even more uncomfortable. It's a, it's a women's issue, like, isn't it? I might today, girls, treat myself to a pair of skims <laughs> thongs and see if they like. I can wear them under leggings. That'd be oh, a then. perfect experiment. But I don't know if they have my size though. Small or extra small? Me and Sienna are like, okay, we're gonna be here ten hours. Yes, it's the time's gonna go easy for Mum. For me and Sienna, however, <laughs> Mia, do you like this? <gasps> But it's oh, purple. I love that. Oh, this brand is really cool. This is Girlfriend Collective. I actually don't have anything from Girlfriend Collective. I don't think I do. I think I bought some, but I returned them. Um, but um, this is like all recycled materials. Like it's Ooh, a really good eco brand. Nice. But look at the colours in that. It's really nice. Very pretty. I know. I love it. I love like looking at athleisure and like living <laughs> in athleisure. Today I'm actually not wearing leggings or a jumper for the what? first time. But I just love this stuff because it's comfy and it makes you feel like you want to move more but then also it's quite stylish. Yeah. I, I think I said on my Instagram before, I can remember when we first started making vlogs and videos, I used to always wear my gym stuff, like, you know, my leggings and stuff. And people used to always comment like, why is the mum always wearing her gym clothes? Why is the mum always looking like she's about to go to the gym? And now look, what does everyone wear? You it's trendy now. I was, yeah, I know. No, I'm not saying it in that kind of way, but it is like, Quite now funny. people like appreciate being comfortable and stuff, which is good. So that's really good. And um, watch your space. My dream would be to create my own athleisure brand. Oh, I know. <laughs> like once the baby's a lot older and I'm not in full on mum mode, there's so many ideas that I've got that I want to, I want to do. But it's just Aww. like actually being able to make them happen. Um, oh, should we look over here, girls? There's some yeah. more stuff here. Do you like athleisure, Sienna, or do you uh, like the more of the preppy? Style I like a bit both. Yeah. Same. I'm literally yeah. the same. I'm either wearing like tomboy skater outfit, something like preppy or like very girly or oh, sporty. Like today's outfit. Like the top is like fancy, girly. Yeah. And then the bottoms is like all tomboy skater. Like, yeah. like these Ooh, would be gifts. I skates, like those. What kind? Wouldn't yeah. they? Yeah. And who loves all the oranges at the moment? You I guys do. know I love my oranges. <laughs> I started wearing low waisted and then I realised it's actually so much more comfortable because they don't dig into your stomach. So I don't know if those ones were low waisted or not. Right. Oh, by the way, I'm allowed to try these on. I, I'm going to try the bra on with it as well because I don't really wear bras anymore since I had my ex plan. Mm -hmm. But I'm going to try these. The lady said I can try it on over my underwear. Ooh. Okay. So it's just been really annoying if I got home and they were too tight. So a little skims update. I tried on the underwear and even though it's my size, I can just tell they're going to dig in and I'm going to still go commando. So I put them back. I feel like she's too fussy. I did actually end up getting the dress. And we're now at this really cool brand. I've got a top from here. That would look lovely on you. Oh, that's beautiful. Don't make me want to return you, the I know why one. Mia likes it. Mia. Yeah, it's called Meow. This skirt makes me laugh. Dad, I promise I will never get this skirt, okay? I promise. <laughs> and mum. And mum, no, but like, especially, you know. I think the Fizz fam should try and make something good here for Mia. So it's Mia, and then what does the O and U stand for? Yeah. Something nice though, please. If you wonder what's going on with me and Mia's faces, I think we said about it in a family Fizz video, didn't we? We're retinol, both doing really retinol. high strength retinol on our faces. Mia's is for acne, mine's more for rejuvenation. And um, it's really drying out all around yeah. our lips. So I'm really sorry about Not that. Fun. I love this coat, and I also so really pretty. recognize this one. Yeah, I wonder. That's really familiar for some reason. That Oh, I just love that. I love shoes. Yeah. Sorry, I think so, Mum. No, it's alright. Don't worry. Right. I just tried on like a million jumpers and I actually did get one of those sporty and rich jumpers. What Which colour? did you end up getting? I got grey. Oh. Basically, got we're going to be going out on Sunday. It's going to be me and Darren's wedding anniversary. It's going to be a little nice treat. But we're going to have like, I don't know, I'm not going to give it away. We're going to film it. It's a surprise. But I wanted to have a nice jumper to wear on that day because it's going to be probably, I looked at the weather, it's going to be freezing. We're now going to go all the way downstairs to minus one because there's a secret area and I don't think mum has ever been there. I can't no, wait to show no. you guys what is there. It's so is cool. Is it where the confectionery yeah. is? No. no. Oh yeah, it's on that floor, but it's nothing to do with confectionery. No. Well, actually it could be. Yeah, kind of. Could it? Maybe. <laughs> so mum, I don't know if you know this, but there's actually the cinema wow. at Selfridges. But if this you go in here, in here, yeah. 
Now, if you go in the cinema, there's something else in the cinema which I want to show you. We can also have a look and see if there's any good films to watch. Yeah. That'd be a good way to pass the time. But yeah, anyways, so if you go into the cinema, this is yeah. like a secret spot me and my friend oh. Sam found. Yeah. And uh, it was when there was this trend going on about the Brian photo shoot. Do you know what that was? Did you see that trend on TikTok? It was kind of a while ago. I don't know what you're on about, sorry. Anyways, look. There's a photo booth in here. Oh, it's should we like do it? It's a special one. Yeah. Yeah. Like photos. Yeah, that's so cute. Yeah. Come on. Literally, I always take my friends here. It's such a good spot. Let's take a photo. Ready? Sit on mommy's lap. <laughs> you need right. to try and make an eye level about there and Go you need tap, to make sure you lean in, Sienna. Yeah. <laughs> What's going on? It takes more! Yeah. Ah, my knees! <laughs> and it actually takes a while to develop because it's like an old one. Look, wait, four minutes for your photo. Four minutes could be dinosaurs! But look, there's wow. all this comfy area. Wow, Selfridges is so big, guys. I know. There's so much to do in here. By the way, this is not sponsored by Selfridges, by the way. It should be, though, shouldn't it, guys? I everyone needs to let Selfridges know. Yeah. We should be the ambassadors, shouldn't it's we? Like yeah. It's like the perfect day out if you live in London. It's always mm. rainy in England, so come to Selfridges, because actually there's loads of kid-friendly stuff mm. here as well, which we'll show you in a bit as well. Look! Ah. Oh. I can't get them out without touching it. Ready? Look at those, they look great. <laughs> look at Sienna. Oh, I'm really glad we got those. Yeah. Aren't you? Right, should we see if there are any films, Mia? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. shall we? So it's just Cocaine Bear, Scream, or Creed. Um, <laughs> I don't know if they're. I don't feel like any of those are suitable. No. I think we'll leave it for today. Thank you, thanks. Right. She did say one of them is Chris Mel, but it's like very I don't very think she should like read us about boxing. Yeah. It looks I mean, like it's probably a 12 anyway. That, that would be hilarious. <laughs> They're not, yeah. That's not my type I of film. No, no, none of them really appeal to me. Films. Yeah, I know, right. Romance. Right. I know where we can go, Sienna. Shall we take them upstairs to the kids' department? Yeah. Sienna yeah actually... I've got some socks that I got um, in the last video. We were here on um, Family Fizz. And, well, let's just say the lady didn't take the tag off, unfortunately. Okay. So I have to go back and ask her. Luckily, you've got the receipt. Yeah, and then the also, receipt, I do so. want to get Kerr and Karma a little something. And it's oh, really fun oh. in the kids' department. And we'll show you all of the fun things in there. Well, so you can Even as them. an adult, it's fun. Mum is going to go get something for Kerr and Karma. I am very tempted to get myself a jelly cat as well. Because I haven't... Well, the last one I got was for my birthday or Christmas. And Sienna got it for me. So, yeah, you know, it's been, a, it's been a good amount of time since yeah. I last got one. And I'm trying to, you know, grow a collection. Anyways, look at this giant piano. Oh. You know what this reminds me of? What's that movie where there's that I'm big, that movie something. big, guys, who remembers that scene where he's a kid and then he turns into an adult and then uh, he's like playing in the department store. Karen Khan would love some a cake lid or do you think they'll end up rubbed uh, into all of my I hair and clothes? I think they will love it, but you won't love it. And also it's oh, reminding me of the time Karma got slime stuck in my hair. I was actually terrified. She's about to do this because she's quite advanced. Oh yeah, she's good but at those. Six plus, oh. but loopy fun. Do you think she'll be able to do that one? I reckon she could do something which is five plus. Yeah. Do that one. Oh yeah, she'll love that, won't she? What about my Yeah. Do you think she might one what, of these? We'll have to show her. No, yeah. I got her one of those craft kits before and it was like five plus and she was great with it. Pom pom plus sand art. Okay, we're in the jelly chat section and Mia's going crazy. A grasshopper! <laughs> I love the grasshopper and this one looks so funny. Okay, that's very not my ideal idea of like cute. Oh look at this, it's a little duckling. It's adorbs. What is this? Snake? What even is this one? <laughs> Snake with a funny. I'm Winston Worm! Oh, it's a worm. <laughs> Right, I'm going to go to the, oh, the doggy food. Come on, you don't. If you don't find that cute, then you, you don't find anything cute. Mum, look what I got. Oh, it's Penny the praying mantis. Look how cute it is. <laughs> very odd choice, but I can see why you chose it. It's very look cute. Look at the face. I'm actually quite proud that my 18-year-old wants to spend her money on uh, jelly cats rather than tiny leather micro skirts. <laughs> you know that one you saw earlier. <laughs> Anyway, I got, right, so I got, ended up getting this one for Karma. Well, I haven't got it yet. I've got to go and pay for it. And then I got this for Koa. It's a colour shifter. He loves taking oh. his cards in the bath. 
Oh, so really? that's really good. He always takes. So I don't know if they're meant to go in the bath, probably not, but he always takes his little oh, hot wheels in the car. Is. By the way, I'm just having to sit down. I'm so tired. Me too. I actually have never spent this long in a shop at all, like a supermarket, nothing, but I'm not complaining. She was saying earlier that she feels like she's morphed into a piece of the furniture. A, a piece of self, you know, one of the fixtures here. Yeah. Right, I so feel like I am like a. A display so let's go and pay for these and then let's go and get the tag off your socks we, and then i think yeah. we should go and look at some more of the restaurants and we, get some dinner because i think it's now dinner time we always yeah. eat early for his fam it's like four o'clock or something now is it maybe four five four thirty five. shall we shall we and then after yeah. this right so i said to you um fizz fam that it's our wedding anniversary on sunday so i want to go and get darren a little like Aww, top or something because we want to take loads of pictures and go out so i'm going to treat him because he doesn't like clothes shopping for himself so by the way guys in selfridges instead of putting faces don't you agree with me me in selfridges i we always always say this that it's really like welcoming and friendly in here isn't it it is yeah it is i would put it in my bag did you yeah, see right. It's thinking. not that welcoming that you can just buy things. Uh, Autopilot. Get through. No, it's really like, you know, so like some shops in London, you might feel a bit like a bit snobby going, it's a bit snobby. Predigious. It's, it's not like that. Anymore. Not at all. Like you can come here. Darren always says, like, hey, so I'd love to go and um, suffer just, but I never feel like I'm welcome. I'm like, Darren, I come in here with so the kids true. screaming. Honestly, it's really, really I mean, friendly. I mean, even just the fact that like people come here just to skate. Like, I know. you don't have to buy anything. You, we it, you really just, do it's sound a tourist like attraction. we're doing a brand deal for suffrages right now, don't And we? even if you're not a tourist, it's still like an attraction, which, a place to go. Which we're not. We just thought this would be really fun, guys, because we do sometimes come here and there's just like, Mia comes here skating. I yeah. come in here sometimes with the kids when it's I also come here to look at the jelly cat. And for food and stuff. So I feel like it's been really cool. And look at Ken. Right, okay, let's go and pay. <laughs> a place we've always wanted to try is Pizza Pilgrims. And they actually have so many restaurants in Selfridges. So I'm really excited to try this one because they actually have a vegan pizza. And like I said, we've never been here before. Oh, it smells good. It smells like Italy. Mm. It smells like... It's exclusive. <gasps> wow. Ooh. I don't know if this one's a vegan. That one might be. Um, I don't know. Let's get in. Try find a table. Yeah. Hopefully there are tables. They do have loads of vegan cheese. Ooh. Oh, come on. Delicious. Pizza has arrived, and we also got these cherry sodas. They're actually amazing. I got another they're Italian. Tea. <laughs> Look, me and Sienna got a pizza to share because they're really big. I'm so excited I'm for excited. this, Sienna. Smells good. I'm in a pizza mood. You guys need to look at Mum trying to take an Instagram picture right now. <laughs> I am addicted to olives. Oh, girls, this is so good. Yeah. Mm. It's about two hours of walking around looking at random shops. It's now dark outside and we're feeling hungry for dessert. So we're My in the My favourite place court. is this cookie place. Oh. I love Blondie's it so Kitchen. much. Blondie's Kitchen. Yeah. Mmm. They're the best cookies. There's also a swoon you love place. And it does really nice that sound like... That sounds nice. Biscoff, not Biscoff, but like, kind of like Biscoff. It's amazing. I think so. Well, do you like you cookie though? No, I don't like gelato meat. Yeah. I mean, we just had pizza, so gelato makes sense to have. Yeah, do you want gelato? Uh, yeah, I think so. Okay. Yeah. There's this place over here called Soon, and they have some really delicious vegan stuff. They've got, uh, which one have they got? A speckle gelato and a vegan baccio gelato. The speckle is like Biscoff. Ooh, speckle for me. Is that good? Mm. Yeah. It's mm. So good. I've actually got raspberry gelato. I went a little bit boring this time, but I really, really fancy it. I think I'm so thirsty. Raspberries are nice, aren't they, I guess? Mm. You're in so heaven, good. aren't you? I am. Bye, Bye Selfridges! <laughs> oh, I'm gonna miss you so much. Oh, I know. I don't know. I've had enough of that for like, yeah. <laughs> We had good such while. a good time in there, guys. I hope you had a good time coming in there with us. Do you want to hold this me? Because yeah. we actually want to reward those, well, one of you, who's actually watched to the very end of the video. Because when we're in the booty bit, we actually sneakily went and bought one of you guys a little special gift. In here is some special makeup, a little makeup set. 
This is, oh, it's been all packaged up, guys. I don't want to we'll break into it. We'll put a prop up of what it is. It's, it's the a Kylie, Kylie lip Jenner. kit. Yeah, it's a Kylie lip kit, and it, the colour is Kylie. It's a matte one. It's a really, really nice colour. And all you have to do, right, so it's going to be a giveaway. And if you want a chance to win this, all you've got to do is comment below, I watch till the end, and make sure you subscribe to the video as well, and then you get a chance to win it. We'll pick someone at randomly once the video has gone live. So I hope you enjoyed watching this video, guys. We're going to see you in the next Fizzy video, which will be me and Darren's wedding anniversary. So we love you so Ooh. much, guys. Bye. 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 Say fizzy.